Okay, well, hello everybody. So today, I thought it was finally time to do my first Q&A. Um, I'm up to four subscribers, which I think is pretty cool. And I figured no better time than today to do my first Q&A, because I'm sure you guys have a lot of questions. Okay, so now the thing is, um, since I do have only four subscribers, no one has really sent in any questions yet, but that, it's fine. Uh, what I'm going to do is, what I basically did is, I wrote down a bunch of questions that I figured you guys might want to know. And that way, it'll work just the same way. So, it's still a Q&A, so uh, it's all good. Okay, now, now I wrote down a lot of questions, so I don't know if I can get to them all, but I'll see what I can do. My goal is to keep the video under a certain amount of time. Okay, now I'm going to get to the obvious ones first, because people are going to want to know these and, you know... Uh, they sound like kind of mean questions, but I'll, I'll just address them. So the first question is, are you bipolar? Uh, not that I know of. Uh, pfft, why would, <laughs> it's such a horrible question to ask. Why would you ask if I'm bipolar? I mean, it's mildly hurtful, but at the same time, you know, maybe some people are bipolar. There's nothing funny about it. Um... Um, it's a slightly sort of personal question to ask somebody, but I'm the one who wrote it, so in a way, it can't be really that mean. Um, so, <laughs> wow, this one is really, this one's almost too much. I can't even say it. Oh, jeez. I'm actually a, afraid to even ask this question, but it says, are you schizophrenic? I don't even find any of this stuff funny, to tell you the truth. These are like actual medical conditions, and there's nothing funny about them. I don't even like to joke around about this kind of stuff. Um, what am I even supposed to say to that? Yeah, not funny. Okay, so third question. What's your favorite product to review? Um, my favorite product to review, without a doubt, is... A future product that I haven't done yet um, so we'll see what that ends up being uh, what is your ultimate goal on YouTube well I mean obviously my ultimate goal would be to get like a million subscribers I think that's probably um, you know that's probably everyone's ultimate goal on YouTube right to get that 1 million subscriber plaque can you imagine me having that 1 million subscriber plaque just like hanging like somewhere in my bathroom. Um, did you end up buying a new wallet case? Ah, so you probably wouldn't understand what that means unless you saw the video I did called Apple slowing down old iPhones. If you watch that video, I guess you'll understand what the question's all about. And no, I haven't. Um, I still use the same Apple case I used before. Um, it works great. Let me see. Actually, let me see if I could, if it's around. Hold on a second. Okay, so. Um, yeah, as you can see, I still got the exact same case. Um, I I still pretty much pay in the same way or use the Apple Pay. It's still just as sturdy. The car doesn't fall out. Um, no complaints at all with this case. Uh, to tell you the truth, there's really no reason to get a new case unless this one starts breaking down, but it's in great condition. So, yeah, so there's no reason to upgrade. But thanks for the question, though. It's... Let's see, what else do we have here? Can you give me the orange USB drive that lost in the comparison video? Ah, okay, hold on a second. Let me go grab it. Okay, okay, okay. So, 
this question is regarding a video I did comparing these two USB sticks in which I, I thought, see I ended up kind of like a fool in that video because I thought the orange one was the clear winner, but it ended up being that these this aqua colored one was the clear winner. Uh, left me a bit frustrated, but hey, you know, it was an honest review, there was no edits, so yes, I did slightly look like a fool for thinking this one was going to win, but hey, I left it the way it was, and so obviously I'm not going to give this one away because I need it because it was a winner. Now, as far as giving you the orange one, I still use this a lot of the times. Yes, it does get lost in my backpack sometimes, but uh, it's still very helpful because it has twice the amount of data. It's got 32 gigs. So if I upgrade to a larger one, then I, I might do a giveaway. I might like uh, do a giveaway for this. Uh, we'll see how things go, though. Um, okay, what is your religious belief? Ah, well, that's an interesting question. I don't, um, uh, I don't subscribe to any particular religion um but uh i definitely feel like you know we're all one that kind of nice stuff um i don't necessarily believe in like a god that's you know like an old man with a beard judging you and telling you what to do and they dictate your life and they tell you when you did something good or bad. I don't believe in that, but I definitely believe in like a collective consciousness and energy. Um, and that's really where I stand on that. Um, okay. Wow, I didn't know this was going to get really metaphysical. Um, have you channeled... What? Oh, right. This question is regarding a, a video I did with the Ouija boards. It was basically asking me like if I've been using the Ouija board anymore and also if I've had any issues with mean-spirited spirits at nighttime. Um, no, I've had no issues. I don't really... I don't really uh, have too many issues at night with things like that. I don't really get nightmares or anything like that. Or, um, but yeah, that one... The one channeling that I did or when I when I did the video, uh that wasn't really that bad. Like I said, I talked to this one spirit and he just gave me like a mild, slightly inoffensive insult. He just said I'm not a particular favorite of his, which is really not that mean spirited. Um so I yeah, that was not really that bad. Um uh, the next question is, what's one product you wish you could review, but it's way too expensive or hard to get? Um, wow. There's so many on that list. Uh, um, it's really hard to choose. Uh, ew, I don't think I can give a particular answer to that. That's a tough question. I mean, you would think that since I wrote the questions, I would have an answer, but that really stumps me. Um, I will say one thing, like as a little teaser, speaking of expensive products, I did recently get my hands on a pair of really expensive headphones that I will do a review on at some point. Um, uh, they're not my headphones, but I have them in my possession, and I'm going to do a review before I, I give them back. Um, so I'll just leave it at that. Um, other than that, I don't really see any other questions. It, it seems like that's basically it. Um, keep in mind, like I said, I only have four subscribers right now, so... Hopefully, if I get more subscribers, I'll actually get more questions and I can do a second Q&A at some point. Um, but for now, I think that was a perfect amount of time because I wanted to keep it under 10 minutes and it's almost at 10 minutes. So what I'll do now is I'll count down. So it's like 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 
two, one, ten. 